hello guys welcome back to the channel welcome back to a new video and today i'm going to show you the details of the new skoda enya coupe rs iv so this is the enya coupe in top of the line version of course the rs and this is the first all electric rs skoda and it really looks amazing so this is a more sporty version of the enya so the coupe style of the roof as the name suggests and let's start with the design let's start with the front where we have the beautiful matrix leds and the front grille with i believe 131 leds that illuminate and it looks gorgeous especially during the night this will look awesome and you see on the rs version we have a very sporty front bumper with gloss black elements a bunch of sensors of course integrated into this grille we have the skoda badge and the lighting signature is gorgeous and now uh, let me show you the side profile from different angle so there we go we have the rs badge here so that you don't mistake it for anything else and i love this mamba green i would say this is the color of this element and the gloss black finish we also have the gloss black wing mirrors and the coupe style of the roof that's always nice to see and from the rear equally as awesome as on the front we have the iv lettering skoda lettering instead of the badge and enyaq lettering as well now you know that the rs version of all new skoda models usually has this part here so the long reflector and here we have it as well so i love the fact that they decided to keep those uh, traditional elements this is the diffuser in gloss black rear view camera and the sensors and if we open the tailgate we have the electric tailgate of course and there we go 570 liters actually so really a lot i believe only around 15 liters less than on the standard enyaq so really very practical car even though we have the coupe style of the roof some additional room and some additional room for your cables now if you press this you fold the rear seats and if you press this you get the towing hook and let's go and put it back to its place so yeah really practicality 10 out of 10 we also have the 12 volt power supply and on the sides you have some additional compartments and if we press this the tailgate closes and really a gorgeous design greets us with those crystal look-alike uh, led lights c pillar look at the incline and huge wheels so i didn't show you the wheels actually these are the 21 inch wheels 255 for the r 21 we have a very aerodynamic wheels on the enya coupe rs and i do need to mention that this car is 10 millimeters lower on the rear and 15 millimeters lower on the front compared to the standard enya coupe now let's explore the interior massive doors and the pattern here so you have the carbon look-alike elements we have the nice ambient lights throughout the whole car so at the rear as well and the pattern here is well known from the other Enyaq models but here you see the special seats look at this the integrated headrest and we also have the lumbar support and here is where you control those seats we have the memory function sporty steering wheel with the three spokes and let's jump on board and see more details the layout in front of us so the 5.3 inch digital cockpit we have the sporty steering wheel with the rs badge three spoke one and the flat bottom here the main star is the 13 inch touchscreen and once again the carbon look-alike elements throughout the whole car so let's see it from different view all right so the main star of course 13 inch screen and then below we have the air vents and also some physical buttons for the hazard lights klima even though with this you go into the menu for the climate so the ac is on touch and we have the wireless charger for your phone driving mode 
selector and the cup holders some additional storage room minimalistic gear selector so drive neutral reverse electronic parking brake and here in the middle the armrest and you can also do this so you can put this outside or keep it here so that you have two areas for the storage let's close this the cloud box pretty decent size as expected from a Skoda so simply clever as always and now the infotainment system if we press the home menu you go into this menu and if you press the menu button you go into the selection of all the things that we have here for the infotainment system now i'm not gonna go through the whole system because i already covered that in my other ENIAC review videos and uh, yeah well you see for example some of the things need to be purchased so for example you can enable navigation in the shop actually not gonna go to the shop so let's go back to the main menu vehicle settings here you can see a bunch of settings but we would need the key for more detailed look and assist systems of course this car is packed with technology and here is where you would adjust it once again we need the ignition for that and let's move on charging let's see this so yeah you see the settings for the charging battery care mode if you press this now you see the explanation it's often enough to charge to 80 percent to preserve the battery the battery care mode helps you avoid long stationary periods at high charge level and thereby optimizes your battery's service life you can enable that reduce ac charging current and release ac cable automatically let's go and see the locations okay so not sure about that but let's go back to the main menu smart link of course you can pair your phone with either apple carplay or android auto and background lighting this car has a bunch of options for the ambient lights you also have the moods here preset moods but i believe we would need the ignition for that so if i just open the doors i believe now we see those lights and yeah, i can't change the color but you see the ambient light they go all the way from one side to another here and also at the back as well so really nice we also have the led lights sun visor with led as well on the side passenger side as well huge panoramic roof look at this huge glass surface and now it is time to check out the rear bench 2 meters 76 is the wheelbase so huge wheelbase short overhangs just like you know on other EV models very practical and here you see the flat bottom we also have the sun shades on this one so even though we have the tinted windows we also have the sun shades and that gives you a full privacy as i told you the ambient lights are at the back as well and now without further ado let's jump on board huge amount of room still left look at this we can see the skoda badge you also see the lovely layout and really this 13 inch screen stands out here you have some simply clever solutions are these the cup holders maybe and we also have the heated rear seats the air vents you can put your mobile phone or smaller elements here and then additional elements on this section now in the middle we also have the armrest so just a second there we go if you open it you will notice that we have some cup holders and this is nice in leather now it is time to show you how much space i have for my head and look at this look at the amount of room that i have and one one meter 87 and i still have plenty of room both for my knees but also for my head now the thing is this car has the panoramic roof but it's got the special design a very thin and that way uh, you have really a lot of headroom so impressive stuff by skoda big thumb up from me
and let's open the bonnet on this car we have 220 kilowatts we have the all-wheel drive layout and there we go we do not have the hydraulic struts so i'll be back with you in a moment all right so as i said 220 kilowatts of electric power and we also have the impressive figures 6.5 seconds to reach 100 and top speed is 180 kilometers per hour which is 20 kilometers per hour more than the standard Enya coupe and speaking about the specs and the versions there are various versions available so this is obviously top of the line rs but you can also get the standard one there are two battery sizes and also you can have the all-wheel drive layout or the rear wheel drive layout so subscribe to the channel to see more and tell me in the comments how do you like this new Enyaq coupe in the rs trim and the rs version actually and that's it for now thank you very much for watching this video do subscribe and see you on the next one bye bye